Can everybody hear me? See the picture? It's a heart. It's a bunch of hearts. I thought of this, and this is going to help some of you. Just a quick little lecture here. Maybe I'll do a long one later, but it's, it's kind of late, and I do have to pay attention to this thing. This is going to help some of you. And I know some people are here on the, on, the, on the trial, but for just regular people, it's going to help some of you. You know when you're going through in life, and I'm sure everyone's dated, okay? Whether you're married now or you, were, you, know, you weren't married in all your whole life. So think back when you were dating, okay? I'm sure everyone has dated somebody, okay? Whether you're a heterosexual, homosexual, I'm sure everyone's dated somebody that you were in love with the person and then, 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 then for some reason something happens, they break out with you or they hurt you and you're devastated and it's, you feel like it's the end of the world and you're never gonna fall in love again and you hate your life and you hate everything and everyone and you're never gonna be able to live because that person broke up with you and you were totally in love with them and you thought they were gonna marry them and spend the rest of your life with them and your heart was broken, okay? So at that moment, okay, at that moment in time when your heart was broken, it felt like the end of the world. Steven said, not really. <laughs> no one has ever broken up with you, Steven? Wow, you must be a stud. No one's ever broken up with Steven. Well, most people have had somebody break out with them or they were in a relationship where it ended for whatever reason. Maybe it was a mutual breakup, but you realize the person, maybe you loved them, but you realize the person wasn't the right life partner for you, whatever, whatever the reason is. But really talking about feeling like the heartache, the heartbreak, the heartache, when something doesn't work out that you wanted to, when you thought would, and you were certain that it would, okay? In that moment, it felt like you'd never fall in love again. You would never meet anyone again, okay? And then guess what? You, you did. You did. You met someone else after that heartache, and you fell in love again. And maybe you even married, okay? Maybe you're still single. Maybe you did not marry yet, but you fell in love with someone again after that cruel, harsh breakup, the hard breakup, okay? And you never thought you would. And yet, somehow, you fell in love again. And maybe you are even married, like I said, to that person right now, still today, for 20, 30 years, whatever. Living with them, having a happy life. And when you think back about the relationship where you were heartbroken, that it was all over for you. You would, ne you would be alone for the rest of your life, okay? But, but, but you weren't. You weren't and things were not the way that you thought they were at that time. Now, the reason I'm giving this story is because it directly relates to trading. In the moment that you think, you can't even conceive that you could be successful trading the market, or, or just, just that you can't even conceive that you could be rich doing this. That like you can't even conceive, and by rich I just mean make enough money that you're happy and you could do this, you don't have to do anything else. Because I, I, rich is such a, you know, I don't want to say rich because what's rich to me is different to you and things like that. But wealthy meaning you have quality time, you've got enough money to pay all your bills, go on a vacation, have a nice life, and you don't have to work that hard doing this. So in the moment that you are in this heartache, you, don't, you can't conceive of being in love again. And you think it's the end of the world. It's the same way with trading. You may be in a point right now with your trading where you can't even, con it seems impossible. It's like impossible that you would ever make 200 grand a year trading, or 100 grand a year trading, or 400 grand a year trading, or ever do this for a job and, have, and be able to quit your other one, whatever it is, okay? It might seem impossible to you that you can't even conceive it. It's like, it's like conceiving of falling in love with someone else after you just had a huge, terrible, terrible breakup, okay? And yet, yet what I just told you about the original breakup and then falling in love again is true about trading, because you, you will. But you want to say, well, when? When will I meet the love of my life? When will I make the money that I want doing this? When, 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 when? I don't know. I don't know. But I know that it is exactly like that. Because when it happens, you never know when it's going to. And it could happen in an instant. And it only really, truly has to do with believing that it can. Because if you're not open to the possibilities, it absolutely will not. And it's the same way with romance. Okay? So if you are not taking active steps to become successful as a trader 
or taking active steps to get out in the world and date and meet other people, you're never going to get over the heartache or meet somebody new and you're never going to be successful as a trader. If you're not taking active steps to create what you want, you will continue to have that negative belief system, that thinking that you will never ever get there, it will never ever happen, it's absolutely impossible, you'll never fall in love again, you'll never do this as your career, you'll never make a lot of money doing it, you've failed forever, you whatever, okay? Because listen, you know, heartache can go on for years too. You know, it's not necessarily, you could break up with somebody and be in love with them for years later and never really give anybody a chance. Thinking that your life's over, you should have married that person, never giving up. But it's 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 not the right person, okay? Anyways, the point is though that it's very similar. It's just so similar because you don't because because there is it's love and tr success in trading. Or I mean, I could say success in anything, but I'm talking about trading right now because everybody here is a trader. But it's so similar because everybody wants to know exactly. I don't, you know, you, you, nobody does. That's the, it's, it's, it's called magic. That's the magic of the universe. And you truly have to look at it like that because if you knew exactly every single thing that would happen to you from now until the rest of your life, how boring would your life be? It wouldn't be exciting at all. Okay. So I, I'm saying this to help some of you, new people, old people trials, so that you know that you, you may feel like and 100% feel like you will never make it as a trader. But it can turn around in an instant, just like love. Because if you were ever in that moment, so think back when you were heartbroken about a relationship and think back and remember, you thought, oh my God, I'm gonna be alone for the rest of my life and I'm never gonna meet anybody, blah, blah, blah. But then you did, then you did, you got married, you had two kids and a dog. And you, you forget that, but relate that to your mind and your emotions right now if you're in the space with trading because it will help you. It will help you realize and connect the dots and say, wait a minute, I thought everything was impossible then, but it wasn't. I thought I think everything's impossible now, but guess what? It's not. And 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 connect the dots. Apple. Well, Trend Trader was trying to find, hold on. Here. Trend Trader.